Welcome to the Comic Cave, it's time for the Comic Cave News. I'm Bo, and here we are. Now this is something serious we usually don't talk about. A lot of things, uh, some of the dark sides of comics and more people's actions. Dark Horse, on September 29th, released their editor-in-chief, Scott Alley, stating that he has had misconduct going back years. And they bring up an incident in 2015 where he bit and grabbed another man's crotch. That's a little eerie. But if you, most people don't know, this guy, Ali, apparently he was one of the co-writers of Hellboy and a couple other comics. And was supposed to have been at the next Comic Con. So that kind of makes me wonder what's going on. And why have they taken so long to release this information if he has had misconducts for so long? So many years. It's kind of strange, like they kept them around because they need to be still relevant and in the whole comic book world because it is a very tight, cutthroat world, but who knows. And then the next question is, with all the stuff coming up, with the Hellboy movie coming out, all the other stuff that they're probably going to be part of, they don't have their editor-in-chief, co-writer of Hellboy, you know, what's going on with this whole situation? It makes me wonder, what is the future that Dark Horse has and who is going to replace him? Because this is not something you take lightly here because this is a very serious accusation is that he's had misconduct and, and just all right bad behavior so I wonder where Dark Horse is going to go and if they're going to stay true and hire from within or are they going to get somebody out from the outside to help them you know get back on their feet and get past this but the main thing is that they released him and that is doesn't happen too often that a major editor-in-chief gets released in any well, anything really like that for comic books or books related. They usually keep that kind of, let the person deal with it on their own and if it becomes a problem, but it apparently has become a problem. And these are also all from inside sources uh, from Dark Horse. So, we've got a lot of questions here and there's going to be a lot of concerns. And I guess hopefully in the next few days before the um, New York Comic Con that we'll find out. So, we'll keep you posted as usual here at the Comic Cave. And as usual, leave your comments below and like, share, and subscribe.